Hi YouTube, this is a video of um, a TV show we were asked to go on in the UK early 2015. Um, the show is Mel and Sue, it's a, it's a talk show run by two comedians who I've liked for a long time. Um, so I was really pleased for Ozzy and me to be asked to go on that show to show off Ozzy walking a tightrope. Because I only had a couple of days notice I had to make a, I had to make a machine very quickly um, uh, the reason I needed to make a machine was because the studio is quite small and I couldn't get my normal tightrope walking machine in for Aussie and I didn't have any anchor points on the wall so I had to build a machine quickly out of metal and because of that, because I was uh, rushing to get it done, I couldn't fit a tightrope to this machine I had to make it suitable for um, a slack line and um, Aussie's calls um, don't like the slack line so much because it's a flat ribbon, very slippery flat ribbon he can't really get his claws around but he gave it a good go. You'll see him trip up a bit at the end, but he's a real trooper, a real hard worker. Um, it was a long day, but um, he hung in there. And it was live TV as well, with a live audience and live, live sound effects. Um, I think he was a bit off-put by um, Mel and Sue um, making sounds of encouragement to him. Um, the sounds are fine, but they'd have been done at the wrong time. And the timing would have been wrong. Um, I know we, at the end, have to encourage Ozzy to sort of hang in there and be a bit patient and uh, Mel and Sue very kindly were edging him on um, but that would have disrupted his com com um, concentration as well as it being a very very tricky trick for a dog to do anyway. So you two, we, um, we'd have lots of comments so if you'd like to leave a comment, any questions um, please do, love to communicate via YouTube. Um, thanks for dropping by and See you soon. Over and out, YouTube. Tight rope walking dog, we've promised, and a tight rope walking dog you are going to get. Please welcome Osbert, Humperdinck, Pumpernickel, and his owner, Nick Johnson. <laughs> It's very, you, very good to see you, darling. <gasps> and this is the magnificent Aussie. Aussie cousin, yes. Now, when did you? I mean, when did you realise that Aussie could tightrope walk? When he was about three. So, what did you start him off on? How does it? How do you naturally find that a dog's got that kind of aptitude? I started off putting him on books. You know, one book and then two books and then little, little signs in graveyards and then bigger village signs, street mm -hmm. signs, and then. And worked up to this magnificent fully functioning. And then just suddenly, well, there was a chain. I have chains, and then he got on you a like, chain. Do you think he'll do it for us today? Yeah. Can, can we can see? We see? Are you ready see? to see a tightrope walking dog? Yes. 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 Okay. Let's hush, guys. We don't want to. Um, don't want to start on Aussie. Aussie. Nice bit of quiet, Aussie going up onto the tightrope. Here we go. Oh, he's very well trained. Look at that. Very, very tense times. Come on, Aussie. That is so good. I love it. Come on, Ozzy. 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 Oh. We've seen this dog do it. We know he can do it. Come on, Ozzy. It's okay. Come on, little one. Come on, little Ozzy. If you're going to tune in to the chase tonight, I'm afraid that's not happening. Uh, we're going to stay with Ozzy all night. <laughs> He's brilliant. Go on, Ozzy. Go on. Come on, Ozzy. Come on, come on, come on. Come on.
to all of our guests, to Nick and to Ozzy. Now, Mel, you're doing it. Goodbye.